better health for everybody, every day. Transforming lives, three minutes at a time. Listen up. This is your daily health tip from The Good Company. Hey there, welcome back to your daily health tip. This is Melissa from The Good Company, and this week we are talking about new wellness spas that are popping up and some of the treatments that they offer. Today I want to tell you about something called halo therapy. And the term halo therapy comes from the Greek word halo, meaning salt. Simply put, halo therapy is the use of salt vapor to treat respiratory ailments, skin irritations, and to combat mental lethargy. For centuries, monks used naturally occurring salt caves to treat respiratory problems. Today, man-made salt rooms recreate these salt caverns with one huge improvement over nature, which is in a halo therapy room, a salt vaporizer pumps dry aerosol salt vapor into the air so you can breathe it deeply into your lungs. Now, salt is great because it's antibacterial, it's mucolytic, which means it loosens mucus and phlegm in your lungs, and it's anti-inflammatory. So a typical session might include you wearing your own comfortable clothing with bare feet, or perhaps a spa robe, depending on where you're having this treatment done. You can choose to sit in a comfy chair, or you can actually lie down with your body on the salt. There will be coarse salt crystals on the ground, much like sand at the beach. Um, and the walls will also be covered with salt blocks. Um, generally, it's dimly lit, very relaxing. One place I went to played a very deep, uh, resonating vibrational music the entire time, which was supposed to add another layer of healing. And a different uh, salt room I sat in played light music. Um, people were reading or quietly chatting during their treatment. You can choose to read, meditate, nap, chat, whatever works for you during your session. Every salt room is a little bit different. Um, I did notice after my 45 minutes of sitting in the salt room that I did have a small cough for a few hours afterwards, which was I was told was part of the cleansing process of this therapy, as it is getting deep into your lungs and really stirring things up. And when you cough out that mucus, you're bringing up maybe bacteria, um, uh, extra phlegm, toxins, etc. But no other uh, side effects for me besides feeling very relaxed. Um, I thought it was a great treatment. I think it's a great thing to do if you have allergies. We're coming up on fall allergy season. You can really get a jump on those allergies by trying halo therapy. So I'm going to leave a link in show notes. You can check it out uh, for more information. And if you're enjoying halo therapy, let us know. Talk to us over on Facebook. 